Hi, it's Jess here and I'm just here with a quick recap of January video. I just thought since I didn't film any of these, I would just show them quickly on camera for anyone who was interested. Um, as you see in the start of January, I covered up with art and I did art and I did this with all of my months because I'm not really a fan of motivational quotes. Um, we'll, we'll flip through to the calendar. This is before I really like figured out my monthly stickers. So I just have some washi down and this full box is from Made by Alyssa. Then I've got a little sticker that I made later to add in, which I've decided each month I would put down whose birthdays were happening the month after, the next month, so I could keep track of who if I need to buy any presents or things like that. And then I have some WordPress blog reminding um, stickers that are actually made too wide for the box and so I had to cut them down because <laughs> I didn't want to waste the stickers. And I just have some sweet kawaii design um, wacky holidays and the weight tracking thing which I did not fill out because I forgot. <laughs> Uh, I also don't own a scale, so I should probably buy one. But this is pretty simple. Now I've got stickers for headers and to cover the extra boxes. But I may do in January. So the first week of January was New Year's week, and I was using completely different sticker paper to what I do now. It's the Avery True Block shipping labels. And I know everyone suggests them, but I'm not a fan to be honest. You can really see in the black here that it kind of just rubs all away. The ink doesn't stay and I printed with laser so I don't think it's as bad as um, as it should be. I think it's it's as bad. It shouldn't be as bad as it should be, as it is. <laughs> Sorry. And um, I was still figuring out what kind of stickers I wanted. So I had checklist, I had heart checklist instead of boxes. The sidebar stickers have completely changed, and I'll probably be changing the dinner menu as well soon. But I decided to make much tinier hydrate and brushing sticker ones. Um, I gave up on the curved boxes because although everyone does them and they are cute, I just can't hand cut them. <laughs> it's just not going to happen. Otherwise. Otherwise, it's okay, the spread. I based it off the Scribble, Scribble Prince Co. sampler and I wanted to make my own because I really couldn't have buy one sampler and should be here from the States. Um, so I made my own. I even made this full box here, which I love. Still love this full box, despite the paper and the designs. Um, yeah, it was okay week, except on Sunday. Uh, my partner and I came down with a stomach virus, which affected us for the whole next week. And the second week, still using the Avery paper, still is not working very well. Um, but well, this is my Duchess Raven Waves spread, and I really loved it. And thumbs up if you preferred uh, Duchess Raven Waves over Lady Lovely Locks, because I know, as a kid, I did. I thought a duchess is higher up than a lady, to be honest. <laughs> but maybe that's just me. Um, yeah, so I didn't think this was too bad. You know, I made some clip art of my, some digital paper of my own with the scissors. I bought some clip art, just some digital paper to make the patterns a bit nicer. I used Sweet Kawaii Design stickers as well as some made by Alyssa. Um, I was going to see Star Wars for the second time with my dad this day but I had to cancel it because, you know, super sick. Um, yeah, I thought it was really nice spread and it's too bad it was wasted on being just in bed all week and not being able to eat and uh, it was terrible. And I thought and I thought I'd do a different kind of motivational quote in the corner here. It's just a quote by Dave by 
Duchess Raven Waves. I never thought I'd say thank you to you ladies, so I won't. <laughs> and then coming to next week, I was healthy again at least because um, there's a, some pretty devastating deaths in the celebrity world that week. Still with the Avery sticker paper. This is my vintage My Little Pony spread because um, I'm not really a fan of the new Friendship is Magic and I grew up with the old ponies so that's why I like the design more of. I found these these uh, official Hasbro stickers on fishpond.com.au and they don't stick very well though which is a pain in the butt but especially during the week when I was using it I kept having to press them and Ah well, it's alright now because I'm not using it. <laughs> um, I finally got to catch up with Star Wars with my dad. It was really good the second time, I gotta say. But otherwise, yeah. It's... See, it's just... The paper just fades really weirdly and really, when it rubs against things, it just doesn't last. Like this one, this sticker is almost disappearing. It's a bit sad, it's not going to archive well, but I guess that's it. Once again, I used Sweet Kawaii Design stickers and some Made by Alyssa full boxes that I cut up because I got it from her grab bag and a few of her icons here. I had only really bought from two shops at this time. Now the second to last, oop, oop, cat. Down, kitty. Okay. <laughs> now this week is my diary week, and I think it's okay. I feel like maybe the pizza passion up here makes it a bit um, busy, but oh well. I still love it because I love Daria. And once again, still on the Avery paper, but this week I've given up on the weekend banner, which I've just stuck to because. Well, first, they're annoying to cut out. <laughs> I'm just really lazy with cutting out, to be honest. And also, it takes up so much space in the box that I could have otherwise used. So here, like, once again, Sweet Kawaii Design and made by Alyssa. But she doesn't make these stickers anymore, I do not think. She changed her shop style since then. Um, and once again, uh, this paper just... Just wasn't doing it for me this week, so I went and bought, I got some new sticker paper in the mail this week and just reprinted all my new stuff. <laughs> but that was the Dario week. And the last week of January is on my new sticker paper, which is glossy. And as you can, I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's just such better quality in terms of lasting. Um, and so much brighter. Uh, so One Piece is an anime about pirates and if you want to catch up, if you want to start it, you have to catch up on 700 episodes, so get going people! <laughs> it's really worth it though, it's such a great show and it's great to binge watch as well, but we've caught up so we have to wait weekly <laughs> for new episodes. Um, in this one I had a few extra stickers, so I had this one from Redbubble of this character and I had these stickers all along the bottom here uh, from a Japanese gacha machine. So I went to Tokyo and they have, you know those machines where you put in a, a coin and it comes out a random toy? Well they also have them for stickers and stationery as well, um, which is usually like folders and things. But I got this Hello Kitty and Chopper One Piece sticker set in one of them, so I just decided to like use the stickers and I thought they went along perfectly, obviously. And they really give something extra to this spread. Um, but otherwise, yeah, I'm just really happy with my new sticker paper. It was, it's actually a fraction of the cost of the Avery sticker paper. If you're in Australia, just eBay um, glossy sticker paper and it'll basically be the first thing to come up and it ships from Victoria. 
and it's 100 sheets for $20 instead of 100 sheets for over $80 from Officeworks for Avery. So this is a much better option. I think prints perfectly and it's, uh, I, know, I got totally converted to glossy. I actually bought samples from that person of glossy and matte and the glossy won me over. <laughs> I just love the way it feels. It feels so good. Um, so that was the end of the month. This is just a quick little video to do a recap. Um, although to be honest, I haven't shown the... I didn't film this one either in February. Here's my first week of Feb. This is a Rainbow Bright spread. I was When I was making these, I was going on a bit of a nostalgia kick. So I was doing a lot of old shows that I loved as a kid. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is with the new, still the glossy paper. Yeah, it just comes out really well. And I thought this was going to be a bit more eye bleedy than it actually is. Luckily the blue, you know, didn't print as bright as it is on the computer. But that was my flip through for January and I hope you enjoyed it. And hopefully in a couple of days I'll have my next plan with me up. And um, please stick around, like, thumbs up if you liked it. And please subscribe if you want to see more. See ya!